What's going on HHS? I'm Ben Leibowitz and today we are looking at one of my all-time favorite movies, Spellbound. For those of you who don't know, Spellbound is a 1945 psychological romantic film noir murder mystery thriller, wow that's a mouthful, directed by Alfred Hitchcock. The movie centers around psychoanalyst Dr. Constance Peterson, played by Ingrid Bergman, who falls in love with the new head of the mental institution she works at, played by Gregory Peck. However, it is soon revealed that this new head is an imposter, suffering from amnesia and possibly the murderer of the real guy. Believing he is innocent, Constance risks her, as the trailer puts it, life and reputation to help Peck's character, who shall be kept anonymous to avoid spoilers, regain his memory. First off, the acting. The supporting cast is really good, with Michael Chekhov earning an Oscar nomination for Best Supporting Actor. However, at the center of it are Bergman and Peck, who give, what I would call, some of the best performances in their careers. The film is also a feast for the ears, thanks to the Oscar-winning musical score by Miklos Raza, and can occasionally be a feast for the eyes, particularly during the famous dream sequence, which is based on designs by surrealist painter Salvador Dali. It almost seems pointless to talk about how well the suspenseful scenes are done because this movie is from the master of suspense. For me, this is a true Hitchcock masterpiece, which is a shame that it is not often mentioned among Hitchcock's best films. Even if you are not a fan of black and white, I would still encourage you to check this film out and prepare to be held spellbound. <laughs> Yeah, that poem was terrible, please forgive me. So in the end, I give it 10 out of 10 white squares. Why something is bland as blank white squares? Go watch the movie and find out. 